Imagine discovering a sophisticated iron drill embedded in a coal block millions of years old. How could its presence in such a remote era be explained long before it's believed that humans reached such a level of technological development? This scenario isn't mere speculation, but a real discovery that shook the scientific community in the 19th century and still remains an archaeological mystery today. In 1852, a controversial discovery shook the scientific and archaeological community of the time. On December 13th of that year, John Buchanan, a respected Scottish geologist and antiquarian, presented to the Society of Antiquaries of Scotland a finding that would challenge conventional notions about human history and technological advancement. Buchanan, born in 1819 in Cambus Nethan, Lanarkshire, was a respected man with a solid academic background. After studying at the University of Glasgow, he became a member of the Geological Society of Glasgow and the Society of Antiquaries of Scotland, institutions crucial for the advancement of scientific knowledge and the preservation of cultural heritage in Scotland at that time. In his presentation to the Society of Antiquaries, Buchanan revealed the discovery of a strange tool found embedded in a coal block millions of years old. It was apparently an iron drill, an instrument whose level of development and manufacture seemed too advanced for the era in which it supposedly became trapped in the fossilized coal. According to Buchanan's account, the enigmatic drill was found during construction work on the Great Western Road, a road leading to the Glasgow Botanic Gardens, about two kilometers northwest of the city. The contractor in charge of the works, Robert Lindsay, a renowned architect and builder, had ordered excavations in the Burnbank lands, cutting through clay foundations mixed with rocks up to three meters thick. During the excavations, workers came across a coal block 55 centimeters thick, which was taken to Lindsay's workshop. It was there that his nephew and apprentice, Robert Lindsay Jr., while removing fragments from that coal block, made an astonishing discovery. Inside the block was embedded an elongated iron object with a seemingly modern design. Initially, the strange artifact couldn't be clearly identified, but once cleaned, it revealed its drill or bore shape. Fascinated by the find, Buchanan sent both the drill and a sample of the coal to the Society of Antiquaries for study. In his presentation, Buchanan emphasized the authenticity of the discovery, backed by sworn testimonies of five workers who witnessed the extraction of the drill from inside the coal block. Furthermore, Buchanan himself claimed to have received a geological analysis indicating that the coal had formed long before man was placed on this planet. Members of the Society of Antiquaries, after examining the drill, agreed that the instrument possessed a quite modern and advanced level of development. However, their initial conclusion was that the iron tool could have been part of a damaged borer lost during a coal search many years ago. Nevertheless, Buchanan's own report presented to contradict this explanation. According to his account, the coal surrounding the drill showed no signs of being perforated. On the contrary, the artifact was mysteriously encapsulated in the coal fragment with no indication of how it could have gotten there. In the records of the Society of Antiquaries of Scotland, Buchanan's intervention was textually recorded, expressing his perplexity at the enigma. I concur with the geological analysis received which indicates that the coal was formed long before man was placed on this planet. However, the mystery of how this instrument, clearly made by some advanced civilization, found its way into the coal's interior. If we trust the workers who saw this relic unearthed, I have no reason to doubt their veracity. There should be a way to explain how this instrument found its way down 2.5 meters to 3 meters vertically. Buchanan's credibility and the solidity of his presentation, supported by testimonies and physical evidence, made the case of the drill found in coal a true archaeological mystery. Despite attempts by skeptics to discredit the finding, Buchanan's word remained firm. This discovery was not an isolated case, but added to a series of findings known as Uparts, out-of-place artifacts, artifacts that seem out of their expected temporal context and challenge our conventional understanding of history and technological development of humanity. One of the most notable cases of Uparts is that of the Koso artifacts, a set of stone objects with apparent signs of artificial processing, discovered in California in 1961. Some of these objects were found embedded in a volcanic rock known as rhyolite, whose age is estimated in millions of years. Despite controversies and debates generated, the findings were endorsed by authorities such as the Natural History Museum of Los Angeles County and the University of California. Another intriguing case is that of fossilized human footprints found in different parts of the world, such as the famous Zapata footprints in Texas 
dating back approximately 200 million years. While some experts have questioned their authenticity, other researchers have defended their validity, sparking an ongoing debate about their meaning and origin. In Russia, the so-called Oklo objects have also aroused great interest. These are remains of what appears to be an ancient uranium reprocessing plant, with an estimated age of nearly 2 billion years. Many scientists believe that these remnants could be evidence of an ancient natural nuclear reaction, while others have suggested the possibility of unknown technological intervention in the distant past. Cases like Buchanan's drill, the Koso artifacts, fossilized footprints, and Oklo objects have sparked passionate debates and alternative theories that question the linear and gradual view of human progress. Some researchers have suggested the possibility of advanced civilizations lost in antiquity, while others have proposed more extreme explanations, such as the intervention of extraterrestrial beings or time travel. Regardless of the speculations, these findings remain fascinating enigmas that challenge our assumptions about the past and remind us how much more there is to discover about the mysteries of our own history. While some of these cases may have eventual conventional explanations, others remain true archaeological puzzles. One of the most recent and controversial examples of Uparts is the Antikythera mechanism, an ancient mechanical artifact discovered in 1900 among the remains of a shipwreck off the Greek island of Antikythera. This device, dated around 100 BC, has been dubbed an analog computer, capable of predicting astral positions with surprising accuracy for its time. Its complexity and technological sophistication have led many experts to question our understanding of the level of development reached by ancient Greek civilization. Beyond the debate about its origin and purpose, the Antikythera mechanism is tangible evidence that there are still mysteries to be solved in our remote past. Just as this finding challenged preconceived ideas about the technological capabilities of ancient Greeks, Uparts like Buchanan's drill compel us to keep an open mind and question our historical assumptions. It's important to note that while these findings may be provocative and challenging to our established beliefs, the scientific community has always sought rational and evidence-based explanations. Many Uparts have eventually been explained by natural processes or errors in dating or interpreting findings. However, cases that remain without a satisfactory explanation continue to be studied and debated. Some skeptics have suggested that these Uparts could be the result of fraud or deception, but in many cases, the credibility of the discoverers and the solidity of the evidence presented make it difficult to dismiss the findings entirely. Moreover, these cases are often backed by respected scientific institutions and authorities, lending them greater legitimacy. Ultimately, Uparts remind us that the history of humanity and its technological development can be much more complex and surprising than we imagine. These enigmas invite us to keep an open mind and constantly question our assumptions, as the past may hold secrets yet to be discovered. While some see in Uparts evidence of lost civilizations or even extraterrestrial intervention, others simply consider them fascinating mysteries that challenge our current knowledge. Regardless of the proposed explanations, these out-of-place findings continue to capture the public's imagination and stimulate debate and research in the scientific community.